Hello Libras. So this is your weekly reading. I'm going to start with the tarot. All right, so universe, what's the current energy between Libras and the person that's on Libra mind? Okay, page of wands. Someone want to talk to you, okay? It's reminding me of the Tevin Campbell song, Can We Talk? Yeah. <laughs> so you see what I'm getting. If it's a person that's on Libra mind, what would you like to say? Okay, so this person wants to clear the air. They want to be honest um, with you. With that Seven of Swords in reverse, um, probably you did um, catch them doing something inappropriate or just them lying. Okay, you can see what I'm getting. The universal person that's on Libra mind, why are they keeping hidden from Libra? You got the Six of Pentacles and the Page of Swords in reverse. So I feel like this is someone that you haven't spoken to for a while because this is someone who's spying on you and then it also seeing like how your life is doing better so some of you guys are in another relationship okay um and they seeing you and your person okay but they want to still talk to you even though you may have another person universe the person that's on libra mind how do they feel about libra universe the person that's on libra mind how do they feel about libra Eight of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. They know that you don't need them or you don't want them, but they still want to try. They still want to try to see if you guys can reconnect again. A lot of Earth, this person could be a Virgo, a Taurus, or a Capricorn. Universe, the person that's on Libra Mind, what is their true feelings for Libra? The Hierophant. Right now, they feel like you guys will work at this time, okay, um, because they're ready for a commitment okay this could be someone who was a cheater um who liked to cheat universe the person that's on libra mind what is their intentions with libra to a sword that's interesting because they don't even know i feel like they don't even know like if you were to give them another chance but they're still gonna try universe the person that's on libra mind what actions would it take with libra okay four of swords ten of wands so yeah, I feel like that's just them basically addressing the elephant in the room, talking about things that had happened pertaining to the past. The universe clarify the two of swords, queen of cups, the universe clarify the queen of cups, five pentacles. Yeah, so this is them feeling like you probably won't give them a chance, but they still going to shoot their chance again, shoot their shot basically. Um, but I do see them being more transparent and being more um, honest with the Seven of Swords being perverse. But a lot of you guys have moved on, though. <laughs> okay, so this person's sign, like I was mentioning, could be Earth sign, heavy Earth, okay? Taurus for a Capricorn. There's some Gemini. Um, yeah. So let's see what else I'm getting for you. Okay, universe, give me a four card spread. What messages do you have for Libras? Okay, clear vision, you're right. The truth, yeah. So the truth is coming out and they're finally going to admit to it. Universe, give me two more cards. So argue for your limitation and get to keep them and my income is constantly increasing. So this is about standards and boundaries. You may feel like this person really crossed those boundaries with you. So I feel like a lot of you guys are just on to better things with that, with this card, okay? Jenna Energy is a high priestess. So you guys have been having a lot of inclination that this person is going to return and trying to make things work with you again or trying to be um, authentic. You, you have an inner feeling, inner knowing that this person is going to do that. And I do see that, okay? With that clear vision, you're right, and this high priestess energy here. So let's look at... this sec okay universe give me a four card spread what messages do you have for libras okay so there is discipline oops then there is peace there is also envy there's doubt and there's worry 
Okay, so again, some of you guys are in another relationship. They're jealous of that. Okay, I feel like them losing you is affecting their ego. Okay, let's look at what they would like to say. Okay, universe, give me a great card spread. The person that's on Libra's mind would like to say to Libra, yeah, they would like to say that they're ready for a relationship now, okay? That they did, they was the reason of why the connection didn't work, okay? They accepted that, but they're ready. That's what they would like to say. They was not taking this relationship seriously before. Okay, let's look at this deck. Okay. Universe, give me a four card spread. Ah. Okay, so there is harmony. Okay, universe. There is disconnect and boredom. There is prosperity begins, ace of pentacles. And this, um, an emotional withdrawal, yeah. So a lot of you guys have moved on from this, okay? A lot of you guys view them as the devil, <laughs> or this is just was a karmic person or a lesson for you. And I feel like with them, they just seeing you like being happy. I feel like a lot of them, they're looking at your Instagram, looking at your social media and say, wow, like Libra is doing really well. You know, if you guys are in a relationship, they just see that you're really happy with your person. And it's eating, this is eating at them basically, okay? It's like here. All right, Universe, give me a four card spread. We must have just see you have four. Libra, the full angel. Universe, give me two more cards. There is Gambler, Child Wounded, Don Juan, Knight, and Rescuer. Okay, yeah, so this is someone who thought like he was gonna like you know wait for them to change okay that didn't happen you move forward okay now they're trying to see how they can fix this relationship when it's probably too late general energy it's messiah yeah they're trying to see now it's mercury retrograde season so <laughs> so do expect past people to resurface okay let's look here Right, Unified, give me a four card spread. So there is let go, improving health. Unified, give me two more cards. The situation will improve. It's up to you, romance, and remain positive. Jenna energy is yes, okay? So I feel like a lot of you guys have let go of this person. Things have been improving in your life, not only just your love life. Um, now, another way this can go, if you're interested in this person um, still, a lot of you guys have let go and you did what's best for you, okay? This is making them change, okay? Um, but is it, like, for those who are so interested in this person, is it the right time right now? It's not really indicating it's the right time, but it's trying, it's trying to say that this person is having an awakening and they are changing somewhat, okay? Um, so probably later down the road, if you're still interested in this person, um, I see that this person will be kind of matching your energy, getting to your level, okay? So let's look here. Right. Universe, give me a two card spread. Got three cards. Self renewals, surrendering, yep, which is what you letting go of this connection, soul journey. Jenna energy is true worth, yeah, because this is someone who's not appreciating you the way that you should be appreciating you. Appreciated, I mean. Um, my true worth is intrinsic and shines from my inner being like a single jewel of love and compassion. Then it is self-renewal. As I clean out old energies, I have more space for that which wants to be birthed into my life. And then there's surrendering. Um, I honor the truth and surrender as it opens me to the gift of divine grace. 
and soul journey. Loving from the soul opens me to the magic that exists when I surrender to divine manifestation on its own terms and timing. Okay. So that's the reading that I have for you, Libras. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a person with me at queenfortetarot at gmail.com.